Do 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 do. How to? Just one set here. So I just wanted to do a little tour around Canvas. I know um, we're learning it, and um, we learn a little bit more each day about it. Uh, but there can be some things confusing. So what I'm going to show you, um, at least the initial setup, I'll tell you what works for all teachers. But then there are some things um, that are specific to each teacher as to how they're doing their assignments. Um, you can try my method. Uh, I know it'll work for for reading, uh, for social studies, um, for writing. Uh, I'm not sure about math and science is not up and running yet. So we're going to start. So always, if you haven't um, downloaded the student, the Canvas student app, you want to do that. Go into self-service and download that. I think everyone has it now, but that's this app right here. So in the lower right. So I'm going to click on that. And this is what it looks like, right? So when you go to your dashboard, sometimes it might open under your to-do or your calendar, your notifications. The to-do is a good um, way to find out what homework you have as well. But I always want you to start at the dashboard, right? And you know what your daily schedule is. Uh, so this is probably even more important for kids that are at home because at school, we're going to help you. We're going to tell you, hey, we're in reading, open up your iPad, click on the on the dashboard, click on your class. Um, but when you're in at home, um, you've got to do it on your own. So follow that same schedule we give you. So if you start out with reading or writing in the morning, you're going to click on this class, right? And say you're going to reading. Um, what you want to do is let it load, click on the reading button. And now from here, you've got a couple of different options. And I went over this with, um, at least the, the A, A cohort, and we'll go over this with the, the B cohort tomorrow as well. But, um, you can always, always for reading, go to announcements and the announcement at the top will be the latest announcement. And in those announcements, um, if you click on this one, this is one from today, it has links to the assignments. So you'll always know what those assignments are. Um, that's a good way of doing it. Well, let me, see, let me go back. So let's go back to the home page and get back to reading. You'll notice I also added buttons here. They're going to pop up. Um, and I'll, I'll change this. So every week it's going to be. So this week we've got the week of 914 to 918. Next week will be 921 to 925. You can press that button and it gives you what we're doing, right? A lot of these are the same. So in school, at home, or online on Friday. And the reason this is the same is because we have an assignment. Um, we're doing the, the first part of the Hatchet Novel Study. And that's a week long assignment. So there'll be times where you might have multiple assignments in it, but that is another good way to know what you're doing. But um, first and foremost, I would always go to the announcements and see what the announcements are for the day. Okay. So let's go. So let's say you have social studies. Um, so inside Minnesota studies, same thing, right? The setup is the same. Um, again, I've got the week of 914 to 918. So this looks a little bit different, right? So, um, there's, there's some modules in there that it points you to, um, that kind of gives you an overview, kind of a sneak peek, but in school, here's what your assignment is. So let's watch this video and read the directions, click on the links. Um, same thing for at home. And I don't have anything for online Friday, but I will. You can always go to the announcements as well. Um, we had an announcement uh, on Monday. Then I gave one out for the fingerprint self-portrait example. This one's a little sneak peek. You got one coming tomorrow just to explain homework. So always go to those announcements. If you are in my homeroom, um, same thing. Right for my homework now, homeroom, you're not going to get assignments, but I will be doing an announcement every day. I do a morning message every day, a morning message video, and it kind of reminds you of key things that we have going on, or 
might direct you to some key assignments. Definitely reminds you to check uh, Canvas when you're at home. So um, that's just a couple tips that will hopefully help you out. Um, it might look a little bit different um, for your other teachers. So I would, I would check with your homeroom, um, but hopefully that helps a little bit. If not, you can always email me. Have a good night.